Hello guys, it's Danek from createproxy.com here. Today I'm going to show you how to, how to easily, fast, create 100 or even 1000 of IPv6 proxies with uh, createproxy.com on a world tour. Uh, so I'm going to log in first to the createproxy.com dashboard and I already created some proxies so they are in my proxy list uh, I'm going to download them there is 100 proxies this 100 proxies ha uh, is, uh, has been created by one single instance so like this I'm going to copy all my all my proxy IPs and I'm going to use proxy proxy extension for uh, Firefox import proxy list Okay, uh, I'm going to reload Google. So Google now see that my my IP address is uh, my real IP address. I'm in uh, Czech Republic at the moment. I'm sorry. Here I am. So it's my real IP address, and I'm going to. To change uh, my IP address uh, to somewhere else. So now we will see that my that my IP address is uh, this IP6 IP address uh, in uh, somewhere in Germany, right? Uh, this 100 proxies you're gonna get uh, with one single instance, which is gonna cost you around four bucks a month. I'm not going to try every every single uh, proxy, just randomly. So as you see, every single uh, IPv6 address is unique. Uh, with every single instance you're gonna get uh one one uh, um sox5 proxy ip which uh is located on port 3128 uh if i'm gonna reload this page it's not gonna work probably uh because uh i just import this uh you have to go to options and click on edit and here for stab you need to select 65 and then it will work so as you see uh my 65 ip address is right now different it's ip4 ip address same uh, as others in germany so now i'm going to show you how, how easy and fast it is to create uh 100 uh IPv6 proxy IPs and with uh, one SOX5 IPv4 proxy IP. They are all yours, they are created by you, uh, they are uh, they are basically, they are not shared with anyone, nobody else can use them, nothing like that. Uh, they are all the data center driven. Uh, it's not like uh, we're cheating someone or or somehow not like this nothing like that so i'm going to close all of this and i'm going to show you now how i did it first of all i'm going to remove all these proxies from this proxy list it's simple as uh, going to account list and click on one single button This will delete all the proxies and uh, this will also uh, delete them from water. And I'm going to also delete the uh, water account. So I'm going to start over. <coughs> okay, so uh, once you are in create proxy dashboard, click on water and then click on add account. And uh, here 
you will need only Vulture APK. That's all setting you will need from Vulture. So, uh, so if you don't have a Vulture account, you can Google for a, uh, some promotion. I think they are offering 100 free credit at the moment. So you can get a free 100 bucks uh, for uh, trying Vulture. Uh, once you have an account, log in and uh, go to the Yappy page. Uh, on the Yappy page, uh, just copy the APK and make sure in access control you allow any IPv4 and any IPv6 uh, use your APK. Okay, then return back to Cryptoxy and insert your APK. And insert the name of the profile. You can create with, with you, you can insert to create proxy any number of Vulture profiles. So you can have like uh, different APKs or different settings. You can have like uh, maybe different number of uh, servers. For example, uh, uh, this input right here uh, means that uh, you, if I insert 100, it will create 100 IPv6 proxies for this account um, uh, this uh, is only setting for IPv4 proxies uh, this setting means that uh, this number will increase uh, this will stop there's the number uh, of the first port so uh, if you insert 100 then uh, the first port will increase uh, up to uh, uh, 20,100 you can also later select uh, that you want to secure your uh, proxy IPs uh, with, I with uh, IP authorization. So you can uh, you can insert here uh, your IPs uh, separated by comma. You can insert whatever uh, how many how many IPs you want. I'm just fine as it is right now. So if you want to insert more, you can just do it like this. Once again, I'm sorry, I'm too tired today. Okay, copy the APK. Here we go. And I'm going to create 100 blue second. <clears throat> That's basically it. Uh, create procedure regards to the page where we can start creating proxies. This is going to select your profile uh, location. I want to do create proxies in London. Uh, I'm going to select the cheapest instance. This one's gonna cost me four dollar a month, and I want to create just one instance. Uh, and I want to select the service IPv6 HTTP proxies, which is new, plus one six five proxy. Secure by username and password. If you want to secure your proxy with uh, IP, you can select this option, or you can uh, not select them at all if you want to. Which is not recommended, of course. So I'm using, uh, I'm going to select the username and password, and I want just one and create. So this will create me uh, 102 proxies in the setting. Okay, now we'll now create proxy redirect me to the uh, uh, list of the proxies. So I can expect here in a few minutes uh, new proxy IPs. In the meanwhile, I can I can add more proxies if I want to. Uh, I select the same same profile, uh, and I want to create proxy in uh, Netherlands. Same, the cheapest one, and I want to create their uh, 200 IPv6 proxies. And I want to secure them by IP and create.
We are still waiting. Okay, we've got uh, first 100 proxies. We're still waiting for another 200 proxies, which are going to be secured by IP, because uh, the first proxies are secured by uh, login. So we have to use username and password for each proxy. As you see, uh, the first proxy is uh, Sox5. And all others are HTTP because they are uh, IPv6, while this is uh, IPv4. Now we have uh, 204 proxies in our list. And now we have uh, 306 proxies in our list. So now we can download all of them just by clicking on download txt. And as you can see, some of the proxies are uh, secured by, by uh, you will not see this, but uh, uh, you know, you know, the, this proxy has been has been uh, secured by IP, so you are not getting uh, username and password uh, along with uh, the IP, and this proxy has been secured by username and password. So basically, you can select all of them, Control C, and we can go over to the uh, Foxy Proxy extension for Firefox. We are going to options. I'm going to delete all the, all the proxies from from all the list, and I'm going to import uh, new proxies. All right. So I just import 306 proxies. Okay. So, what is my IP? Because the Foxy Proxy is right now uh, using my IP address. So, I'm going to select uh, randomly one IP from my new list. And voila, the thing is, where is the neck? The neck is in Netherlands right now. It's connecting to internet from Netherlands. I'm going to select another one. Yep. So as you see, we are using different uh, IPv6 IP. Another one. Uh, each port of of uh, the instance is pointed to unique IPv6 IP address. So we're just gonna select a different different uh, different uh, IP IPv6 address. Oops. We've got totally different IP. I'm not going to try every one of them since I will be here till to to morning. Uh, another uh, one more thing uh, is that the 
the 3128 proxies are set 5. So, as I showed you before, we have to go to because uh, it will not work again. So, we have to go to the options. Set 5. Save. And it's working. So yes, uh, this service is available right now for Wilter only, uh, but I will add this uh, in uh, coming weeks uh, for uh, another providers, probably for most of them. So it will be, it will be possibly um, added for a digital ocean uh, in the uh, next week and uh, later it will be for more providers in, including uh, Google Cloud and Amazon AWS. So thank you for watching and uh, see you in the next video. Bye bye.